This is a video about how to reuse your Google Classroom from one year to the next. So I'm going to focus on this class right here, this math period one. So if I go into it, let's just take a look at it. I can see I have an announcement right here where I wrote welcome. Uh, there's classwork in there and there are some students in there as well. Okay, let's go back to my all classes page. So I'm going to start by archiving it. So if I come to these three dots in the upper right, right here, and go ahead and select that, and I just go down to archive. Okay, so it drops off my all classes active page here, but I can come up to the pancakes in the upper left, go ahead and select that, and go down to archived classes right here, and I'll see all the classes I've archived. They look a little different. They have the lines running through the, the header of the class, but um, the title is the same. So now if I wanted to restore it, again, I would come to the three dots in the upper right here and I could just hit restore. It would put it back on my active page. But what I want to do actually is make a copy of it first. So let's go ahead and hit copy. And you can change the name here if you want. So let's just call it math period one 2022. Give it a slightly different name and I hit copy. OK, so it's going to copy over um, all of the classwork. Uh, but the rosters of students and any announcements will not be uh, a part of the copy. So the copy ends up back on the active all classes page. So let's get out of archived classes and go back to here. And, and here it is right here. Gave it a different color header, but um, if I go into it now, I can see the new title here. I, I noticed there are no announcements here so it got rid of the announcements if I go to classwork they're actually grayed out so they're not they don't show to the students right now and if I go to people there are no students in there okay so what I would need to do the following year to make something active and visible to the students is to come over here to the dot 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 you can see it says draft right now so if I go ahead and select that and I go to edit it I just need to repost it so up here in the upper right where it says post if i go ahead and hit post and post it will become an active uh, resource in this case see you can tell the difference it's uh it's got color to it it's not grayed out and now i can go ahead and use that with my next class so that is how you would take a class from one year archive it copy it and reuse it the following year